The following video will give you an introduction to the Yokogawa DL9000 Signal Explorer series and demonstrate just a few of its capabilities. This video will illustrate how the DL9000 offers you the best combination of performance, ease of use, and value among digital oscilloscopes in the 500 MHz to 1.5 GHz range. To start, we will introduce you to the user interface and then simulate two common oscilloscope applications. The first application involves making automatic measurements on repetitive signals, and the second application will cover how to detect and isolate anomalies. Let's begin. To familiarize you with the DL9000, let's choose a scenario where the instrument had last been used by another person just before your first encounter. You can see that some buttons are backlit, while others are not. Here in this case, the Start-Stop button is backlit, which indicates that the DL9000 is actively running. The Zoom 1 button means that Zoom has been activated, and the Bright Param button indicates that we are measuring waveform parameters. Out of the four input and four math channels, we can see that only channels 1 and 3 are active. Yokogawa's unique system of backlit buttons gives you an easy, intuitive view of the DL9000's configuration without ever having to push any buttons or enter the menu system. By double-clicking any of these backlit buttons, you can easily toggle those features on or off. The DL9000's display area also gives you useful information about the oscilloscope's configuration, such as trigger settings, channel settings, memory, and sample rate. Unlike our competitors, only Yokogawa oscilloscopes will show you the actual running acquisition count. Now that you have seen the basic interface, let's look at how to make measurements using the Yokogawa DL9000. All digital oscilloscopes give you the ability to make simple horizontal or vertical cursor measurements. One shortcoming of these cursors is that their accuracies are usually limited to the pixel resolution of the oscilloscope's display. The Yokogawa DL9000 avoids this problem with its two independent zoom windows. The independent magnification and position controls significantly enhance the resolution of a vertical cursor measurement. Inside the cursor menu, you can select from six types of built-in cursors, including horizontal and vertical, voltage at time, markers that snap to the waveform, and even a serial cursor for digital applications. If you ever caught yourself decoding binary zeros and ones on the display of an oscilloscope, you'll appreciate the Yokogawa DL9000's unique serial cursor. This serial cursor can automatically decode your binary or hexadecimal strings at any bit rate, saving you time and eliminating human error. Think of all the various cursors as semi-automatic tools for making waveform measurements. The Yokogawa DL9000 can also make fully automated waveform parameter measurements. To do this, simply select which items out of 31 choices you would like to automatically measure in real time. Although other oscilloscopes can perform most of these basic types of measurements, the DL9000 differs in several ways. It lets you measure more parameters simultaneously, allows for custom equations, and operates asynchronously. This means you can get the most calculations with the least impact on update rate. Basic waveform parameters are limited to giving you just a measurement snapshot. The DL9000 can go beyond this by continuously calculating statistics for any parameters. For example, let's configure the instrument to measure rise time over multiple acquisitions. On the display, you can see that the DL9000 is giving us continuous information about the rise time, including max, min, mean, and standard deviation. In addition to basic and continuous parameter statistics, the Yokogawa DL9000 offers special advanced analysis functions that can further interpret and extract measurements. Specifically, you can choose from a real-time XY plot, display an FFT of any signal, make harmonic calculations, display jitter histograms, perform advanced parameter analysis, and even decode serial protocols like CAN bus or I2C in real time. 
In this example, we are monitoring the same rise time trended over several minutes. This gives you insight into rise time stability with changes in temperature or variations in other system components. Only the Yokogawa DL9000's powerful data processing engine can give you these meaningful analysis methods with nearly no sacrifice in speed. In fact, the DL9000 supports two simultaneous advanced analysis windows, so you can choose to analyze two serial buses in parallel, or view an FFT in combination with a histogram, and so on. Using the Yokogawa DL9000's extensive measurement functions, cursors, waveform parameters, and advanced analysis, you can characterize nearly any aspect of your signals. Now, let's discuss a second common oscilloscope application, debugging and isolating anomalies. To catch a glitch, you need a combination of low dead time between acquisitions, display persistence or accumulation, and a flexible library of triggers. Yokogawa's Advanced Data Stream Engine, Accumulation Mode, History Memory, and Triggers are unmatched for this type of application. All digital oscilloscopes experience some dead time between triggers, but the Yokogawa DL9000's 400 nanosecond minimum dead time, or 2.5 million waveforms per second, is industry leading by several orders of magnitude. This means you're the least likely to miss an anomaly compared to other oscilloscopes when using the same settings. Digital persistence, or accumulation, can be a useful way to preserve a signal on the display long after the event has passed. In this mode, all waveforms, including anomalies, will remain present on the display and then slowly fade away. Sometimes it is best to start with infinite accumulation when you don't know exactly what you're looking for. If the event you're interested in monitoring occurs sporadically or infrequently, then either a color spectrum or count-based persistence can be a more intuitive way to preserve waveforms on the screen. Only Yokogawa oscilloscopes offer count-based persistence, color spectrum accumulation, and the ability to turn persistence completely off when you don't need it. Other oscilloscopes will show you everything in just one display layer. Only Yokogawa's exclusive history memory will automatically segment and preserve thousands of waveforms allowing you to view, play back, and even search for anomalies long gone by. In this example, we are scanning for a glitch using history memory. Once we have found it, we can set up the DL9000 to trigger just on that glitch by using one of the hundreds of possible combinations of triggers in the instrument. In summary, the Yokogawa DL9000 Signal Explorer stands alone. It is easy to use and gives you an incredible assortment of display, analysis, trigger, and connectivity tools. This video has shown you just a small fraction of the available functions in the Yokogawa DL9000. For a more thorough demonstration or laboratory evaluation, please contact your local Yokogawa sales engineer. Thank you for watching.